Well, let's go meet our first guest, shall we? Let's do it. Yeah, Tim Dines is here. He's a local baker and the owner of two companies, Just Sourdough yeah. and Baked, a That's cookie right. company. And you can actually see Tim coming up at Westfield's Farmer's Market tonight. Hey, Tim, how you doing? Good, how are hey, you? Hey, good to have you Happy here. Good to have you here, Tim. Here. Thanks for yeah. coming here. You go right here in the middle this there. This all looks right. amazing. This is incredible. I know we're going to get a little tutorial on how this all gets started, but first, give us an overview of what you do. Okay, well, I make everything in sourdough, so bread, cookies, brownies, all that kind of stuff. If you have a recipe that has yeast in it, yes. I can convert it Amazing. and okay. make it in sourdough. So today I brought with me a selection of white sourdough bread, whole wheat sourdough bread, rye sourdough, pumpernickel sourdough. Wow. Everything is sourdough and then I also brought, and these are still hot. Mm. Ooh, um, I see the are, steam on the bag. Yeah, yeah these are jalapeno cheddar. Oh, they're Ooh. on. They're at my number one loaf. I, so. Smells good. I confess, yeah. I didn't realize that there were more than one varieties of sourdough. Most people don't. That's okay. why I brought so many. Yeah, well, thank you for understanding the assignment to fill up the demo bar. I know, it yeah. looks so yeah. good. Now, you have a demonstration over here that's yeah. going to kind of provide some background on how this yeah. all gets started. Yeah, sure. So, this is a sourdough starter. This is 100 grams of sourdough starter. Okay. This is enough to make almost all of those loaves. Wow. It's, really? It, well, one loaf of any type. Okay. I okay. should okay. put it that Got way. It. Yeah, yeah. That's better. Um, so how do we get this? By the way, this is sourdough discard. This is, this okay. has no nice big bubbles in it. Yep. As you can see, it's all flat and smooth. Yeah. yeah. This goes in the cookies. Okay. Oh, nice. so you're using everything. So, yeah, we don't throw anything away. That's great. Okay. And, and the, really, the beauty here is that these ingredients that are on the table, yeah. along with a little bit of salt, that's all that's in there. That's it. So what's really? in here, sir? Flour. That's flour. Flour. Okay. So sourdough starter, it's flour and water. Okay. They mix together. They sit on the countertop mm. and they ferment. Okay. And that's how you get the power to rise to raise that flour up and make that bread. Okay. That's really and cool. And if you want to kickstart it, you yeah. can give it like an eighth of a teaspoon of molasses when you mix it up. Really? Why is that? Well, the added sugar is consumed um, in creating, uh, by the bacteria, you know, that create the, uh, yeah. the process. They like that stuff. Yeah. They like chewing That's down, breaking down the yeah. sugar. Yeah. So you've got th the flour and the water go together okay. and the protein in the flour acts with the water to make gluten. Okay. And gluten wow. is that structure that, that the bread needs to stay up. If you don't put gluten in here, when it comes out of the oven, it's like this instead of like okay. this. Okay, right, right. understand, right? yeah. So that, that's deflated. how that works. Do you yeah. use just standard flour here? What are you using? Well, this is bread flour. Okay. And I just use the best one I can get at yeah. the time, but it's always non-GMO. Non-GMO, non okay. Non-GMO, oh, filtered like water, because we don't want to put chlorine in there. Yeah, yes. right? good, good. So. All we have to do is take these and mix them together. This is 150 grams of water and okay. 150 grams of flour. We always do it one to one, so yeah. it's 100 yeah. percent. Okay. I am so fascinated by this. I've never this is, done this process. It's so this cool. is a great thing to do with kids yeah. when they're at home because there's a lot of math involved. Right. Help them measure okay. it. Yep. So then all we have to do is mix this up. Okay. Yeah, this would be a great Easy science enough. lesson, yeah. and then you get some delicious bread at the end. Yes, you do. <laughs> now. This is also a great way to feed this starter. If okay. I want to use this again, yeah. I can store this in the fridge for up to about a month. Wow. Oh, wow. Right? Okay. So that it doesn't have to be thrown out and fed every day. Yeah. Well, I can pour my 100 grams in here Okay. with this, so and in about six hours, six yeah. to eight hours, it'll be up here at the top wow. of this. So this is the living culture. This is, That yeah. is making everything, that gives you the sourdough that kind of tang to it. Yeah. It does. Okay. And, and here in, in the Midwest, we don't really get a whole lot of tang. Yeah, sure. Because we're not in, we don't have that environment like San Francisco where they really get the bite to it. Yeah, yeah. Um, so we wind up with a very mild sourdough bread here. Okay. Um, and it's, it's good. I mean, yeah. yeah. People well, love it. Well, you know it. what? I feel like we got to try a little bite. I feel like we, we need to do a, of course. a little bit of quality control. Just to, I'm, I trust <laughs> yeah, you. A little quality control. Yeah. I trust you, but uh -huh. I just got to make sure. We just got to make sure. <laughs> what should we try a bite of, do you think, Tim? Well, the easiest, um, since I didn't bring the knife on stage. No, that's all right. That's is okay. a cookie. <laughs> oh, okay. So, oh, yeah. What do you perfect. like? Chocolate chip? Yes. Yeah. I Anybody like peanut chip. butter? You know, I love peanut butter. Yeah, I'll try some. Thank you. Give it a shot. During the month of June, you can actually use code Indy now to get 10% off. Thank you for 
offering. Yeah. That. Yeah, I forgot to activate it before I got here this morning. Oh, okay. So it will be active when I get home. <laughs> okay. Sounds good. So maybe just wait a little while. Yeah, yeah give me an hour. Him, let, he's a small business owner after all. Let him let him activate. This yeah. has an interesting consistency. Oh, this to is it. like thick. Yeah. yeah, that's nice. Cheers. Cheers. Okay, here we go. That's I've never had really a sourdough excited. cookie before. Here all we go. right, here we go. Mm. Mm. Oh, that's really oh, good. That is that's incredible. my wife's favorite. The okay, peanut butter. I can see why. It's delicious. And this has the perfect amount mm. of chocolate chips in it. Super good. Oh, drop when, some. <laughs> where at the Westfield Farmers Market can people find you tonight? I am number 24. Okay. So mm. there's this like half half circle thing that faces the band. Yes. And yep. I am on the right at about the apex of okay. the circle there. Make sure you stop on okay, by tonight. You. Go say hi to Tim. Let him know that you saw him on Indy Now. Pick up some of his delicious breads, cookies. Yeah. Um, you will love them. Yeah. This Tim, is delicious. Thank you. Great. Thank you, thank you, you very much. Here, thank you. Oh, that was great. Too. That was awesome. Thanks. Fun stuff. Thank you. Thank you. There's the code Indy Now, 10% off. Well, coming up next, we want you to be our guest for a delicious half off dining deal at 101 Beer Kitchen in Hamilton County. We'll be right back with that deal that you can grab right after this.